Hi, you're watching another episode of Bar Chat with Siobhan and today I'm going to be looking at whether the bar is male, pale and stale. So there are approximately 16,400 practicing barristers in England and Wales, but how many of those are male and pale? So 79% of the bar identify as being white, 12% are BAME, there's 8% that we don't currently have statistics for. So when you stop and think that 79% are white, immediately you think, oh, this is predominantly a profession that is dominated by white people and that perhaps there's not op as many opportunities there for people from other races. If you look at the racial demographics across the country and averages, the statistics are actually very similar. In England and Wales, the population is roughly 86% white. When you compare these figures at the bar and in wider society, they are actually quite proportionate. However, that doesn't mean that there are not barriers for people from, for example, black communities when trying to initially access a legal career. So when I first saw that there were um, nearly twice as many men practicing at the bar as women, I was a bit concerned as a working mother that there may be less opportunities for women or that it may be an environment that isn't particularly welcoming to women. However, over the years attending different networking events, and getting more insight into a career at the bar, I have seen that there are opportunities there. So Northampton has three chambers. A chambers is like an office that barristers are based in, and all three chambers have female heads. So while it does seem that there is a large gap at the bar for women still, it is fairly in line with national working stats. So although um, there's still room for improvement at the bar, they are already taking a lot of steps to improve equality and diversity. So for example, there's mentoring opportunities, there's networking events that specifically focus on, say, women at the bar, lectures, and various other events that will help to support you through the beginning of your career. So there's actually loads of different opportunities for support throughout your career, ranging from at the beginning when you start as a student, right up towards the end of your career as a judge or QC. So I don't think anyone should be deterred by the fact that the bar is, or appears to be, predominantly male and pale, because these statistics are in line with the general working population. Mm -hmm.